Hey everyone, I'm Nick de la Torre with Awaken Catholic and welcome to Awaken the Word. Today we're reading from the Gospel according to Luke. Then they told what had happened on the road and how he had been known to them in the breaking of the bread. While they were talking about this, Jesus himself stood among them and said to them, Peace be with you. They were startled and terrified and thought that they were seeing a ghost. He said to them, Why are you frightened? And why do doubts arise in your hearts? Look at my hands and my feet. See that it is I myself. Touch me and see, for a ghost does not have flesh and bones as you see that I have. And when he had said this, he showed them his hands and his feet. While in their joy they were disbelieving and still wondering, he said to them, Have you anything here to eat? They gave him a piece of broiled fish, and he took it and ate it in their presence. Then he said to them, These are my words that I spoke to you while I was still with you, that everything written about me in the law of Moses, the prophets, and the Psalms must be fulfilled. Then he opened their minds to understand the scriptures, and he said to them, Thus it is written that the Messiah is to suffer and to rise from the dead on the third day, and that repentance and forgiveness of sins is to be proclaimed in his name to all nations, beginning from Jerusalem. You are witnesses of these things. Do we really believe in the resurrection of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ? Blessed be his name. Do we really believe it? Because if we really believe that this resurrection was a historical fact, something that really took place, if we believe that, then nothing should make us waver from our peace. The degree to which we lose our peace, the degree to which we are anxious about anything, represents some degree that we do not believe in the resurrection. In today's passage, our Lord exposes his wounds. He shows, I am here, this really happened, and yes, I really did resurrect. And so he says, peace be with you. Why are you frightened and why do doubts arise in your hearts? Look at my hands and feet. See that it is I myself. And that's the same thing that our Lord wants to tell us, that our Lord is telling us through today's passage. And in prayer, our Lord says, be not afraid. Have peace. Peace be with you. Regardless of whatever it is that's going on in our lives, regardless of what things are stressing us out at work or what bills we're having a hard time paying or what relationships we have that are contentious, he says, be not afraid. Peace be with you. I conquered death. There is nothing I can't do. I have been Nick. This has been Awaken the Word. And before you go, I just need you to know that Jesus loves you. Peace.